Hello, hello, what's up, everybody? Welcome back. All right, you guys, so let's go ahead and jump right on into it. Listen, y'all, so you know what? Um, we're gonna go ahead and talk about my jazzy life, of course. You guys saw the thumbnail, the title, and everything like that. Um, and then we're also gonna go ahead and get into how come she doesn't have $14. <laughs> like, I mean, Jasmine is broke, broke. You don't have $14? Oh, okay, great. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into it, y'all. Um, let me go ahead and share my screen. How is everyone doing on this good Friday? Listen, it seems as though, like, the weeks, they're going, they're flying by. Days are flying by super fast. Like, listen, I'm glad, because, <laughs> <laughs> shoot everybody ready for this weekend with everybody's easter plans my mom she plans on cooking tomorrow um instead of sunday so yeah we're gonna be going over to tomorrow and i you know text her i was like i make sure make sure you have some good vegetarian um you know um dishes you know so so i could you know eat good too with y'all because if you don't know um I'm taking a break from meat, so I'm going, like, on a meat cleanse. So, um, yeah, I'm going to see how long I last. Um, first, I'm going to start out with just one month, and if I feel good after this one month, then I'm going to continue to do it more. So, I'm going to just see how I feel after this one month. But, um, okay, y'all, so let me go ahead and share my screen real quick. Um, oh, I'm about to say, like, where is it? <laughs> <laughs> okay y'all so we gonna start with this video because i did want to react to this video before the whole you know who blind mess with her and philip started so um we're gonna go ahead and start with this video and it's this is gonna go by fast because it's only like two things i probably wanted to say um i think but you know what um the music is playing so i'm just gonna go ahead and play this part real quick so you know what jasmine what she does she lays out her clothes She'll let, she's laying out her clothes to make sure she has a, a nice little outfit to wear. Um, what, what day was this though? Okay. So I guess this was it. Zeus. I'm sorry, y'all. Somebody just texted me. I'm like, who is this? Their number is not even saved. Oh, okay. This is this one girl. Um Yep, so she getting the kids off to school. Oh my goodness gracious. Jasmine, you know what? I'm you know what I'm done. I'm I'm done with it. I'm done with it. Like, why does my Amaya have to be forced to go to school with those those old shoes on? I can't really see who was that that just walked out the door. Who was that? Wasn't that Aiden? Why would why did it look like he was wearing girl shoes? Oh, okay. No, that was Ava. I'm like, okay, I know he is not wearing no girl shoes. Um but come on now, please. It's just ridiculous at this point. Like, really, what's really going on? I mean, it's it's starting to be a crime shame. Like, this is real. Fresheners. I got two different kinds. And I also got another plug-in for Caleb's room. I got some more all-purpose cleaner, some spoons, because we just don't have any spoons. Some foam plates, because who likes to wash dishes? Dishes, what dishes? But yeah, I talked to my doctor and they told me I need to take more fiber, um, more spinach. So I did get some stuff for a you know 50 50 baby spinach and spring mix salad. So just bought a whole bunch of nothing, I bought a whole bunch of nothing. That's what it's looking like to me. Like, girl, I mean, we we want to see you go shopping for your kids, we don't want to see you just picking up little knickknacks from the store. But you only went to the store for the, just to get 10 items, that's it. Come on. Ball game, super, super, super excited. Um, I had to run a little bit behind. Um, the dad had to actually come by so I could do the girl's hair real quick. So I'm rushing, <laughs> but headed to her game right now. So let's go. Ooh, Philip came through. Okay. <laughs> we already know what he came through to do. Don't try to be, don't be trying to blame it on the girl's hair. Mm hmm. Can Hannah can throw the girl's hair in a pony sail. Stop it. Okay. He came through so he get really quick. Like, Jack, first and foremost, you know what? It's this, it's this nose ring for me. 
Um, Jasmine, you don't need to draw no more attention to your nose than what it are. You need to stick with the super small nose ring, boo, because that nose ring right there is just making your nose look a whole lot bigger than what it actually is. Mm. So I can do the girl. You keep on looking in the camera thinking that she a fine done done. Oh, mm. let's, let's, yeah, let's, real next, quick, let's <laughs> So I really, I really didn't even really watch um this part right here, all like that. Like <laughs> I really did not. Um, so I really don't know if Kaylin was playing good, but I mean I saw a little bit towards the end of it, and um Kaylin, Kaylin is to me she's very timid. Like you know she um like for a girls basketball you have to be aggressive. I mean, like, you got to get your butt in there. Like, you got to turn off the, you know, the shyness. You have to get your butt in there. All right. And, you know, I think that's something that Kay, like, you know, Kaylin, she, I don't think she, you know, ever wants to, like, try to steal the ball from somebody, you know, because she doesn't want them to be mad at her. Like, she just tries not to, you know, anger anybody. That's the type, I mean, that's what I get from her. But, I mean, you know, um, she still has a, a way to go, but she has improved a lot. She's improved a lot. So she she is doing um better than what she did last year. So I'm I'm glad for her for that one. <laughs> all right, so we're about to skip through this because during this part, you know, I guess Jasmine, we all know how Jasmine is at the basketball game. She yells like super loud. Um, you know, she yells and tell tells Kaylin what to do and Go over here, do this, put your arms up, get, uh, call for the ball, get the ball, call for the ball again. And you know what? Listen, Ubi, it burns me up because um, my kid's father is that same way. When we, when we go to our boys' football games, I'll be, Ubi, I have to stay far away because it irks my nerves. Like, I'm like, let the coaches do their job, all right? If you want to go out there and coach, okay, go be a coach then. But you yelling on the sidelines, you saying one thing, the coach is saying the other thing. They don't, they have to listen to the coach. I mean, they can't just be going based off what you're saying. You're not the coach. Be quiet and let the coach coach the team. Goodness gracious. Like, I mean, okay, Jasmine, if you want to be a coach so bad, girl, go up. Uh, I mean, what? I'm pretty sure they have open positions for it. Well, how come you didn't do it? Oh, okay. What it was was it affecting your gym schedule? Is that what it was? So we're just gonna sit on the sideline and yell. That's what we're gonna do. Oh no, no. Be quiet or apply for the damn position next time. Because all this yelling is just uncalled for. That's annoying as hell. Like I'm surprised nobody told her to shut up. I cannot be around that. I can't. It really irks my nerves. Uh. I was like, uh, this is not enough. I need a little bit more. I need a little bit more, uh, okay? Because I wanted to get it in today. Like, I told myself I was going to push myself to my full is potential today. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm prepping that. And then I'm also checking on Legend's corn dog, his breakfast corn dog. It's just a sausage pancake corn dog. And I realized that it was not ready. So I went ahead and put it back in there for a couple more seconds. And then it was ready. I get all this together before I even get him ready because it just makes everything go a lot smoother because he is slow. Okay. Especially in the morning. He don't want to, he don't want to be bothered. And he's like, mama, just leave me alone. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and get him dressed and ready for Okay. Prioritize your peas. Prioritize you being the best version of you. And so that's what I did today. I told myself well, I'm I was still going putting to him on that too so small after code. I got Bye. listened together, I went ahead and grabbed my battery just in case my camera died. Then I went ahead and did his cup for the day so that he can have his water at childcare. A lot of you guys were like, why don't you just put him in regular childcare or daycare? Um, do you have 800 and something dollars? Because that is expensive and the waiting list is extremely long. Jasmine, be quiet. Here she go again with this waiting list. So they only got one wait, they only got one daycare around you. <laughs> what? Make it make sense. They only have one daycare. Stop it. 
stop it. And $800, girl, that's what you're talking about, full-time prices, because that's what it sounds like, $800 a week, full-time prices. You're going only for part, you're putting him in only for part-time. So stop it right now. Like, girl, stop. She just makes up so many darn going excuses for me. I mean, okay. I mean, you know what, Jasmine? You don't want to put him in. It's fine. It's fine. I mean, you know, because girl, by the time what? When he starts, when he was four or like when he's about to turn three. So he, he should be available for head start half the day. So, I mean, are you even going to sign him up for that? You could sign him up right now so that. You know, instead of waiting till he actually turned three, sign him up so that they could know that he's coming next school year round. I mean, you know what, Jasmine just be. Um, I I don't I don't get her. I don't get her. Like she's just only concerned and worry about herself. That's it. That's it. And I don't mind him going to childcare while I work out for two hours. Look, at the end of the day, he still has fun and I'm still able to work out and focus on myself. Okay, but you should want better, Jasmine. Like he needs to be somewhere learning something. Learning, not learning how to touch his nose when you say nose and touch eyes when you say eyes. He should know more than that, Jasmine. He sh That's why people are recommending you put him in a part-time daycare to where he can actually learn something. Thing. But since you don't want to do that because you're so dang going cheap when it comes to everybody else, how about sign him up for Hair Start right now to avoid the waiting list? Just in case there is one, which more than likely there may be, but you could still sign him up. Goodness, this girl, I cannot. And that's Ooh. really all that matters. My twins were with me majority of the time when they were little. So at the end of the day, just do what works for you. And yeah, the free daycare works for Jasmine. She's cheap as hell. Girl can't even afford $14. We're going to get into the $14 here in a minute. But um, let's go ahead and skip through this because you already know it's not a Jasmine video unless she's somewhere bending over in a um, gym. So let's get. I think that's it for this video anyways. One yeah, I believe that's it for this one. But let me see. To keep falling, and then I got the girls. Where are they? Well, I really got them for Ava. These earrings are so pretty. Okay, don't they need shoes, um, Jasmine? I'm gonna put them on her for Easter, and I got this as well for myself. But that's everything, y'all. I'm about to oh, she got that stuff for herself. Let me some lunch. I didn't even see this part. The stuff that she purchased from um, what was it? Five and below. It looked like. I don't think you brought Blanky. No, okay, y'all. So we're at home. Um, I did stop at Five Below. I, I got some out. socks. Really for me and Caitlin. Because she needs some more long socks, too. And I saw these there. Mommy, but I originally went there because... Mommy. Hold on. So Legends on this. Uh-oh. What happened thing? Okay. And he keeps saying it over and over. Okay. What happened? I don't know. Let me take off his shoes. No? Okay. Go. So I don't know. She was we were both using the headphones and then all of a sudden we charged them and they just Okay, come on. And they will not come on. Like we don't know. So I just got I just until I can get me get me and her some more beats. I got her some wireless ones. Okay. And I got some me some wireless ones. Because we've been both using the headphones and I don't know, they they just don't and I got this to the car mount. Put my phone this stuff about my phone because it keep falling. And then I got the girls. Where are they? Well, I really got them for Ava. These earrings are so pretty. Um, I'm gonna put them on her for Easter. And I got this as well for myself. But that's everything. See, you know what? <laughs> here we go. Nika the third. Nika the third right here. All I keep on hearing is hey, this is for me. This is for me. This is for me and Caitlyn. Why? How come Caitlyn can't have that whole thing to yourself? You just got yourself some socks. I saw some Nike socks on you. Stop playing. You got you some name brand Nike socks. How come she can't have that whole thing of socks and she's the one who need them? No, this is for me and Caitlyn. Dang. 
I mean, what? You can't go shopping either for your kids just for them and not get yourself anything? Okay, these headphones is for me and Caitlin. Oh, yeah, I got some jewelry for the girls. Oh, no, wait. No, this is only for Ava, but, ooh, I also picked these up for myself. Like, dang. Your kids need shoes. They need a little bit more clothes. And you just out here, like, like I said, buying your little knickknacks. And you can't help but to buy yourself something. Man, listen. Mm -mm -mm. Here we go. Girl, we don't mind about to watch that. <laughs> Stop it. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into her new video that she just uploaded today. Right? And it's titled, of course, another clickbait. I moved in with my Baby granny. Bosses believe right? She said grandmother, but I said granny. Um, so you know, I mean, you know, of course, it's clickbait. Nobody's clicking on it, Jasmine. So just give it up. Um so let's go ahead and get into this one real quick. And y'all gonna see why she can't afford, I mean, you know, why she can't, why she doesn't have $14. <laughs> right, really? Okay. Oh, wait. Here we go. No. No. Oh, you wanna love? Oh, I just wanna fuck. Ooh. Oh no. Fuck. <laughs> no. Oh no. Hey, what you Oh, Jasmine, I'm gonna need for you to get that together. I did not need to stop. I always had that habit. Someone said that when you work out, your body is releasing some hormones and stuff like that. So that explains why I'm breaking out. Um, I did contact a dermatologist, the one I went to last time. I remember what she gave me, but that stuff like really, really dried my skin out. But she did also um, suggest like the Neutrogena. I did use to use that a lot, the Neutrogena body wash and Neutrogena like face wash. That helped with, especially my body, because I break out a lot on my arms and it's crazy like how I break out. Yeah, I stopped at the gas station. I didn't even tell y'all I already been recording and got me an energy drink. He had his lunch. I was like, I'm not stopping. Three to four dollars. Um drink. for him. I'm just gonna warm something up and then we're gonna just go. So he ate and fell asleep in the car. Um after I leave the gym, I gotta go to PetSmart and grab some dog food. I was like, Kayla didn't even because she always feeds him. So she didn't even tell me that he literally he had one bowl left. So I filled his bowl up with the rest of that food before I left. So I still have to go do that. Also, y'all, something else happened. So I was in the girls' room getting uh Ava's clothes. I laid down on my zip. I was so tired that morning. I looked up and it's the ceiling was leaking. And we had, like I told y'all, a really bad storm. It came through real windy, all that. And I'm guessing it affected something on that side. I couldn't really see because it's on the side of the house. So someone came out and they went up there. So they're going to repair our roof over there because it's like in the corner of their room. It's like in the corner, like between the okay, ceiling bitch, and the Okay, we don't wall. care. It's I mean, so what? It's in the corner. Okay, that's what? You already said it. That's a little weird to me, me. but um, I haven't really talked to y'all in a bit. I know I've been just working out. A lot of y'all were like, Jasmine, you don't even talk no more. You just work out. And honestly, like my content, I hate the fact that I was look, I was editing and I was like, dang, all my content is just me working out. Excuse me. Comment down below if that's okay. Like, do y'all enjoy the workout content? Um, I do plan on adding some more content into it because that's just... What's going to happen if we say no, Jasmine? What's going to happen if the people said no, that they, they don't enjoy the workout content? What you going to do then? Nothing, but keep it going with the workout because that's what you do every day. The hell? I mean, what's the point of asking a question when you won't continue to do whatever you want to do? You want to work out every day and show it on your blogs? Do it then. It's your channel. Do it. <laughs> Look, don't be trying to ask people for suggestions and, you know, want to see if that's okay, that if people want to see that or whatever. Girl, <laughs> somebody say no, what you going to do? what i'm gonna, i'm just gonna i want to i want to add in more content i want to do some what traveling to myself and you know of course with the kids but i'm gonna add in some more content i still have to get some stuff I, i'm supposed to go to get some stuff for his easter basket older for their grandmother she always comes through with their easter basket so i don't have to worry about theirs and she was like you don't worry about, don't buy no extra easter basket and i was like thank you because i really was like really about to go get them one but she was like no don't go buy none because i got there she did theirs totally different so i'm super excited oh lord Listen, we need to drop one of Clues Bombs for um, Philip's mama because she be always coming through. Now, you know what? I'm not going to say nothing about, you know, um, her, you know, making the kids Easter baskets because that's usually what grandmas do except for my mama. Um, 
Uh, no offense, mom. But yeah, um, <laughs> but that's what usually what grandmas do because when I was younger and, you know, like I said before, all my cousins, they lived with my grandma. My grandma was taking care of them. So um, just me and my sister, my brother, we always, you know, our parents took care of us. So when we, whenever we went over to my grandma's house, which was all the time, damn near every day. Because, you know, my mom and my grandma was super close. So they'd be sitting out on the porch gossiping and talking about the family. Y'all know how that is. Okay. But, um, yeah. So we would be going over there all the time. And then my grandma, she will always make us Easter baskets as long, I mean, you know, with the other, with all of our other cousins who lived in the house. So, I mean, that's stuff, that's stuff for grandmas to do, you know. Um, yeah, I hear a lot about, you know grandma's making you know their grandkids easter baskets i'm gonna make my grandkids easter baskets as well but um yeah i'm gonna need for my mama to step it up excited about that the easter outfits are super super cute y'all will see all that in the easter video but i do have to oh okay so then grandma paid for the easter outfits too i mean damn jasmine you couldn't come you can't meet her halfway i mean she had an easter baskets i see easter baskets but now you asking for too much easter outfits too Oh, yeah, she got the Easter outfit because she already knew that you wasn't going to come through with it. Okay, continue. I have to get stuff for his Easter basket. I'm trying to debate, like, do I want to go and I have so much stuff I have to do today. Like, And honestly, you guys, what I should have recorded the other day. Somebody is, people are so crazy. Just because I go visit my grandma, they think that I'm going to visit her, get money. Now, let's be completely honest, y'all. Me, I grew up. Y'all don't know too much about my backstory. My mom worked like three to four jobs. Um, my dad was also working until um, my dad became a stay-at-home dad. I was living with my grandma. We don't care about the backstory. Sorry. Don't care. Don't care we're gonna skip this up i mean what you went over to your grandma's house usually when you go see granny you want something you either want her to put something in your name or you want some dollars i mean what to purchase a house but it was still expensive back then so she worked three to four jobs i barely saw her so i'm gonna say this that's why i never and that's crazy because you know Jasmine's dad was a stay-at-home dad while the mom was out there working three jobs that's terrible I don't care what anybody say. If he ain't, you know, disabled or anything, he needs to be out there working at least two jobs as well. So to alleviate her, why does she have to work three jobs? That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. That's why she having all these um surgeries and things going on with her right now because of all that ripping and running and doing everything that she was doing when she was younger. Like, that's too much. Like, no, I would never be, you know, happy with, you know, no, no. Watch, watching my spouse work three jobs while I'm sitting at home with the kids. Okay, yeah, taking care of the kids, that's a big job in itself as well. But you can tr contribute. If you can, you can get your butt out there and you can contribute. Y'all can work, you know, one person work first shift, the other person work second shift or second shift and third shift, who, what, however else you want to put it to where, you know, the kids have an adult there at all times. Oh, wait, shit. And to make sure that we have a nice house and my dad. So I lived with my grandmother. I was with her majority of the time. And then plus my grandma was like, come over. Cause I was getting my car. Um, I was getting my girl, car with that. We don't need sure to hear the long ass excuses. I mean, girl, you went over to your granny's house. Just leave it at that. Who cares? Why does she like to explain herself? Plus I was doing this. Plus I had to go over to do this. Plus I needed to go check on her. Plus she wanted us to come over. Girl, you went over to grandma's house. That's it. That's it. <laughs> you explaining yourself for what? People still will think whatever they want to think. And stuff like that. He just wanted to make sure everything was good. But I also wanted to go to my grandma. And she's like, come visit me. I cook, y'all. I was like, she's like, I cook some rice. And I love me some African red soup. And we put it over rice. And he likes it. He's the only kid. Him and Amaya. Him and Amaya are the, are the only ones that will eat it. Um, The African red soup. So she's like, bring Legend by. And it was, I should have recorded. But I had other stuff going on dealing with drama, y'all. It was so much. And a lot of y'all kept thinking, oh, she's talking about Chris. Y'all, I'm not talking about him. Just leaving it at that. Here she go again. Here she go again. Didn't you already say that you didn't you already come on here and say that you wasn't talking about Chris? We all knew you wasn't going to say nothing about, bad about Chris. How much you still defending this deadbeat loser? I mean, girl, it's at this point, it's it's embarrassing. It's embarrassing. Like you're still defending this deadbeat loser. We know you're not going to we already know you're not talking about Chris. <laughs> Stop it. 
I mean, bro, he's not watching your videos, Jasmine. You don't have to come on here and try to defend him no more. He don't care. But long story short, um, I went over there and she was reading her books, her new book. I, I told you about my grandma's new book. She's actually, um, she said that it actually costs more to purchase it through Amazon than through her. And I'm trying to figure out a way to help her. I'm going to talk to my aunt because my aunt helps her with that part. I'm going to figure out a way to help, see if she can get an affiliated link or something. That way people can purchase it. Hold on, y'all. So let me go ahead and see if she even, you know, put something in a description for her grandmama's book. Because I did see the title of the book, like, in the, in the blog way back. And I'm not trying to go all the way back there to look for it. So I guess she don't want nobody to buy the book. Um, I don't see anything in the description, but let's continue. She said directly through her, and it's cheaper than on Amazon. I think it's like $20 on Amazon, but her, she's selling it for $14. So um, I told her I was going to purchase one regardless. So... I just ain't have right now, okay? Okay, I have to still pick these kids. So I told her when I get paid, I'll go ahead and report. Uh, if you don't get the hell up out of here, I am done. I'm done with Jasmine. If she don't get her butt up out of here, yo, what did you just, let's go ahead and take that on back. We got to rewind this one back because this is embarrassing. And you know what? The fact that she just, just this came out of her mouth is beyond me let's go ahead and go man something that way people can purchase it directly through her and it's cheaper than on amazon i think it's like 20 dollars on amazon but her she's selling it for 14. so um i told her i was gonna purchase one regardless so i just ain't have right now okay okay i have to still pick these kids so i told her when i get paid you don't have $14 to give to your granny who, what, didn't she put the car, in, either put the car in her name or got the car insurance for you or something like that in her name? Girl, you did not have $14 to give to your granny for a book. Jasmine, you know what? Ooh, -wee. I cannot. You got to be the cheapest, most selfish person there is. You know you have $14. Who don't got $14? Stop playing with me. Stop it. If you don't have $14 in your pocket, you don't have $14 in the bank or, or in the car. Like, I don't carry cash. So, I mean, you don't have $14 in your bank on a prepaid card or anything. I'm cash app. I mean, what? You don't have $14 nowhere. Now, I'm not saying spend your last, if you got $14, spend your last $14. But you should have more than $14. Girl, you have five kids. You have bills. Anything could come up. You're driving a car. You don't have no money on you. That's what you're saying. You told grandma you have to wait. She has to wait until you get paid. On the 21st of April. Jasmine, you know what? Ooh, we. I couldn't be grandma. Because, girl, that would be the last time you ever asked me for any damn thing. What you was trying to do? Get a free book off of grandma? You was trying to get a free book off of grandma. That's what it was. Talking about, oh, yeah, grandma, I don't have it, but I'm going to have the next. And then, she, and then grandma would be like, oh, no, here, baby. You could go ahead and get this for free. Yeah, she you was trying to get a free book off of grandma. That's not about to work. No, no. Just because your family doesn't mean you get anything for free. You pay. I mean, wouldn't you want that same courtesy and respect if you were selling something? You know what? She gets on my nerves. I cannot. I cannot. Like, what? Make it make sense. Oh, yeah. I got these kids. and did it. Bro, you're not even paying for Easter. What are you talking about? What are you doing for the kids, Jasmine? What did you do? You haven't purchased the kids' shoes, clothes, nothing. You're not purchasing the kids' Easter baskets, their Easter outfits, nothing. You're only out to a baby. Listen, I wish y'all, I wish y'all, all I had to do was deal for, I mean, you know, put up money for one child. I would, don't, don't we all want those luxuries of only having to, you know, we have multiple kids, but we can only, you know, pay for just only one child stuff. Yeah, we will all love those luxuries. You tell you telling grandma that you cannot afford a $14 book from her because you don't got it right now. And she has to wait all the way until the 21st of April to get $14 out of you. Oh my goodness. Man. Jasmine. Wow. Wow. And the fact that you just thought that that 
you was just saying, you know, you was telling us like, I mean, <laughs> like what? I mean, how did you picture this in your head? How did you th th thought that this was going to go? I mean, you just she felt so confident in letting us know that, you know, she didn't have $14 to give the granny. I mean, you know what? OK, yeah. OK, maybe Jasmine was going to go ahead and pay her $200. Let's go ahead and play devil's advocate. OK, maybe Jasmine just only had $200 to pay her bill for tomorrow. Still, you should still have extra money. If you don't have extra money, you're not budgeting your money correctly, boo. Just still, I don't care if you had a bill tomorrow. I don't care. If you don't have extra money, now it was, it, that means it's time for you to pick up another um job, pick up, pick up another side hustle, pick up a something. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. You're doing too much. You're doing too much. Like, really? No. Like, really? Goodness gracious. I cannot. I cannot. <laughs> like, yo. And I was hoping that she would have put grandma's. I mean, I don't know why. You're talking about your grandma's book. Wouldn't you put it in your description just in case if people wanted to, you know, hear about it so they could come to it? I mean, you know, um, let me see if there's somebody in here asking about granny's book. Okay, she only had the link to a new video. Where's grandma's book? Um, let me see. Let me see. Okay, okay. So I see that, you know, we have time to go through the comments and, you know, delete the negative comments, but we don't have time to, you know, like and, and either like and, you know, press the heart button for people who already commented the, you know, the, um, the um and left good feedback comments for you oh okay great anyways like you know what everybody already knows jasmine don't care about her subscribers we clearly saw that what the other day okay but continue jasmine oh goodness hey i'll go ahead and port, uh purchase it and then i will share it with you guys and i'm gonna see if my aunt can get like some kind of affiliated link so that we can get some purchase and it's a really good book it's basically um she just wanted i'm just proud of her y'all because my grandma did her thing she kept talking Hi. and like we can try to figure out how to get her an affiliated link or something i don't know i don't want y'all to have to purchase it through amazon and pay more and then she only gets a portion of it because it goes to the it goes through a lot of people you know what i'm saying so I and mean, i want her she doesn't really care but i just want her she deserves every dime you ask me okay because she she really did a good job on that book but um so you know what we'll go ahead and wait until jasmine posts this link because i wouldn't mind purchasing um the book just for grandma because you know um i like supporting grannies especially black grannies so um yeah so we'll, we'll wait and see if jasmine will actually post this you know link guarantee we won't see it with that being said, y'all, I'm all over the place. It is now 109, so that means the gym is open. It opens at 1. I'm about to wake him up, and we're about to head in. Um, so, let's go. Here we go. Run him, run him, run him, run him, run him, run him. You know, uh, I'm, not, I'm not in to see another, you know, but, but, um, only fans, but video. I'm not doing it. We will skip right past that workout. Not doing it. Um, where we at? Where we at? Where we at? Oh my goodness. Okay. It's had a really good workout. Um, today was upper body, but I also did a little bit of glute because y'all know me. I'm trying to build a BBL that I would pay for. So it is windy. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. So I think that's why it's kind of windy right now, but that's okay. I actually changed my shirt so that I don't come out here sweaty as heck. Um, I gotta go to, oh my God, I gotta go get Bentley some food. And I told myself I was gonna go to Dollar General, I think, to get a few things oh. to go in his e-basket um, that he keeps asking for because he sees it at the top of the laundry room. So gotta get a few things and then <sighs> we'll head home. The kids will be home later on tonight. I probably gotta wake up early and do something to their hair. I don't know, I still gotta get stuff also for, hair because i don't know if they're getting their hair done or not so i'll probably have to just get a few things um to do the girl's hair but i don't know what i'm gonna do to it anyway so listen um oh. Kaylin's asking. <coughs> excuse me so before jasmine even gets started with that so you did have 14 dollars. you just didn't want to you know spend it on granny's book you wanted granny's book for free you didn't want to spend it on granny's book that's what it was 
Okay, got it, Jasmine. Mm -mm -mm. I hope grandma's listening to this. I hope granny is listening. So asking me to flat iron hers. I'm really considering putting a perm on her hair because she wants it straight. Um, or let my mom do a perm because I don't really know how to do it. I've never done a perm. You know what? If she don't get the hell up on out of here with this, you know what? Listen, and I don't you, uh, listen. I'm all for perms. I'm all for, you know, a lot of people don't like to use the word perm, relaxer, or whatever you want to use. I'm black, we use perms. Um, so um, I'm all for perms. You know, especially when they are needed. But Kaylin does not need a perm. Jasmine, I don't get what's wrong with these ladies. I mean, these ladies have girls. They have multiple girls like Nika. I'm not too sure if Chrissy does her daughter's hair. I don't know. I don't watch her enough for that. Um, but yeah, so they have these girls. I know Wineglass, she does her daughter's hair and her daughter's hair is natural. So, but um. Um, so with Nika and Jasmine, I mean, they don't, they absolutely don't know anything. First and foremost, Kaylin, her, she got, she has a good graded hair. She does not need a perm. She don't need it. She don't need it. I mean, Jasmine, take her to the shop. She wants her hair straight. You think that the only way to get her hair straight is to give her a perm and no dummy. Take her to the shop or watch a YouTube video. There are so many, and I do mean so many YouTube videos out here of um, natural hair girls who have even way coarser hair than um, Kaylin's because her hair is not thick at all. Jasmine says it's thick. Girl, you don't know what the hell thick is. You don't, Maybe you need to go take a trip over to Nika's hair videos and see what actual thick hair is. Your daughter's hair is nowhere near thick, boo. Nowhere near thick. All right. Thick is when you can you can you can't even put your hair up in a ponytail because your hair is so damn that going thick. You're going to need the strength of Zeus to do that. No, no, Kayla's hair is nowhere near thick at all. And you know what? The simple fact is that Jasmine she just doesn't. Oh my goodness, I just don't get this girl. This girl's so dang gone lazy, so dang gone lazy. I don't know how to do perms. I'm just probably ask my mom to do it. No, she don't need a perm. Look up videos or take her to the shop. No, better yet, take her to the shop because I don't, you don't know how to do nothing. Take her to the shop. Watch how the lady at the shop do it. They're going to cook, wash, condition her hair, blow dry it out. You have to get the right blow dryer with the teeth. Blow dry it out. That's it. A good blow dry, it has to be a good blow dry out. And that determines how that silk, silk press comes out. It has to be a good blow dry. Jasmine, she just don't know nothing. I can't. I cannot. I cannot. It's crazy. She don't need a perm. But I think I'm going to let my mama do it because I don't know what I'm doing. So um, when it's I went and got my it. shot, I'm going to do a whole update, though. But I'm also say when I went and got my shot, she did tell me that I need to drink more water. I'm not drinking enough water because I told you I got constipated. More water, okay? So, um, oh, we still I have water. to drink more water. Um, you got money for that? That way. And I need... And she's like, I can either take a daily fiber supplement or um, I need to eat more berries and stuff like that. And like my protein shakes, she said, you know, just go ahead and use your premier protein, add some berries. And or Leaving yeah. all toxic. She all about herself. I got my shots. They told me I need this. I need that. Girl. I need to get spinach. I don't know when I'm going to get spinach, but I need to get some though. But I probably won't get it till tomorrow. Uh, I'll probably eat one of my TV dinners tonight. Only because that's just what's in there. Or unless I eat a drink a protein shake. Just depends on how I feel. But, 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 we about to eat. All right, you guys. We are at PetSmart. About to grab hey, this. this is the first time where I've ever seen Jasmine walk in a dang on PetSmart. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Maybe she probably did it, but I've never seen her walk in a PetSmart before. So this is new. Um, dog food. His dog food be like $20. Let's see. There you go, y'all. Let's see. Should we, get him, we got him. I got him chicken rice. I'm gonna get him lamb meat and brown rice. Twenty three dollars. Okay, Leave it alone. Let's just get you a blue. Twenty three dollars. Okay, girl. How much you got you for You gonna help me? Come on, come this way. Okay. <laughs> just let go. You got it. Yeah. Okay. Come, on, come this way. Come this way. <laughs> Good job. Guess I'll get one of these. 
little Mario things. Make sure it works. Uh uh, it's for your Easter basket. I'm gonna get him one of these. You about to go crazy for that stuff. Get some bubbles. Ooh, there's a puppy. Y'all, they have uh, nothing that has Elmo yeah. here. At okay, all. well, you don't know, just need always Elmo crap. Come on now. Oh. I always give oh, away too much. We get sick and tired of that song, too. <laughs> but let's do something else. Okay, so she put together um Legends, you know, Easter basket. Um, for little Leggy. Okay, it looks nice. It's cute. It's cute. You know, not too much candy. So that's saying he really don't need no candy all like that. So she got him some good stuff that he'll need and use or whatnot. So that's good. Anything else? It was stuff all over the place. Um, I'm currently doing Aiden's laundry, trying to find some balance putting swipes up. I'm saying that because y'all, I just you know how you can feel yourself just being overwhelmed with no balance. I feel like I have no balance in my house, like like a schedule. Like I don't, I really don't have like a, I have a schedule for like during the day, like going to work out and come back home. Oh, we know that. But whenever it comes to like doing my stuff around the house, I have zero. Oh, okay. So when it comes to, you know, actually doing more important things, you don't have a schedule. You just only have a schedule for yourself during, the, you know, your workout. I mean, wh how is that a schedule, Jasmine? I mean, what what is the say on that schedule? Oh, go to the Y. <laughs> That's it? I mean, what? How is that? How is that a schedule? I don't know. <laughs> Zero schedule. Like there's just be stuff just everywhere. And it was just, it's getting on my nerves. It's giving me anxiety. Like the laundry. I swear I cannot find balance with that. Like no matter how how, how hard I try, it is hard. Like I don't know about y'all, but I struggle with doing laundry all the time. Um, I actually hid Legend's Easter basket because he kept he came in here and saw me doing it, and I was like, Freak. <laughs> so um, I hid it. I put it together, put it inside my uh, closet so he can't find it. I'm about to eat me a um, TV dinner and then. I'm about to just chill. I need to. I really need to edit. I need to take a shower. I haven't took a shower. I'm still in the same clothes because oh, I was just like, I'm gonna clean up. I might as well clean up in what I worked out in. I'm not gonna take a shower, and get all sweaty and icky. Um, I have to clean this house, but my kids will come home probably like in two hours. And honestly, I, I just gotta get. They gotta stay. How do you say it? Disciplined with cleaning up because they half ass sometimes clean up their. Mess. Okay, Jasmine, so that's when it's on you to make sure that they stay on it, not you be in the room and expecting them to, you know, do what they're supposed to do, especially if they don't do it on a daily basis. That's when you have to actually be present, Jasmine, and stay on top of them and make sure that they actually do those things. You can't just, when they come home, okay, kids, um, clean up this, clean up that, I'm I'm gone, or I don't think, I don't even think Jasmine even says that. I think when the kids come in, she's in her room already laying down. They, they're they fixing their own stuff. Y'all remember, she already told us that. How old is Amaya? She's like eight, nine years old. She's in there cooking ramen noodles in the microwave. All the kids making their own stuff. Um, Kaylin's helping out the twins, you know, probably making them a hot pocket or whatnot while Jasmine's up in the room chilling, laying down in the bed because she's so exhausted from going to the gym. She's burnt out. Man, how are they supposed to know about anything that they're supposed to do, Jasmine, if you're not present? I'm done. Mess. Um, and it's because they want to get on their phone. And I'm just going to have to be like, okay, look, if y'all don't clean this up, I'm just going to just not give it to you for a week. Like, that's just that. Because I'm just tired of trying to do everything. Cleaning, cooking, trying to balance life with five kids by myself. That stuff is really difficult. And then trying to balance bills and stuff. I just feel like I got to get overwhelmed sometimes. Um, and y'all just really didn't see that because I just got overwhelmed. I sat in the car and I just got irritated. I started thinking about all kinds of things like, damn, it must be nice to wake up and not have to worry about do dealing with kids because I, I can't I can't just sit here and say, I'll wait until another day. You know what I'm saying? I have to do it. Like, so I get overwhelmed with everything and I started reflecting on everything. Yeah, ja you know what? And Why did not take it out? And you know what? And whose fault is that, Jasmine? Whose fault? It's yours. Have you been down there to the courts to, you know, try to arrange child support or anything like that for him? Or, you know, even up the child support that you have going on with Philip? Have you done anything? 
No, it's it's okay. That's your fault. Don't sit around here talking about, oh yeah, um, I had to sit in a car because you know I'm so overwhelmed with bills and stuff like that. What is okay? What you telling us for? What? Oh, you think people about to go ahead and start cash apping you? Like, okay, here's a cheer you up, Jazz. Okay, here's for the next going towards the next bill for you. No, girl, we all, I don't care. We all, it's a whole bunch of single moms who watch your channel. I'm a single mom. We Everybody got bills to pay. Everybody got rent or mortgage to pay. The, what, Jasmine? What? What, you, what makes you so different? I mean, what? You talking about, oh yeah, it must be glad to wake up and not have to worry about your kids. That's your fault. That's your fault. You go down to the course and you make them worry about your kids. That, that's on you, Jasmine. Change it. Take it out on everybody. Not my kids, but the other people that help produce the kids. Okay. So um, I just get irritated. That's really what it is. I get real irritated. But um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. Like I said, you my kids will be here soon when they get here. I'm going to. I mean, her nose ring is so distracting. It's hard trying to listen to what she's saying because uh, my eyes keep on zooming towards this big nose ring. It's it's not, no. It's not nose ringing it for me, Jasmine. Dang, 45 minutes. Oh, my God. All right, y'all, my bad. But yeah, y'all listen. I guess we're going to stay tuned to see if Jasmine, you know, got, you know, went and got um, Kaylin's hair perm. Because if she did, I'm going to cuss her out. Because, yeah, that's not needed. That's really not needed. She don't need it. But um, just take her to the shop. <laughs> but, yeah, you guys, that's it. Go ahead and like this video. Comment your thoughts down below. And subscribe, you guys. I will catch you back. Yeah, I will catch you guys later. Peace.